the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's PSG, they face Manchester United, and it's live on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. It's Paris Saint-Germain versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, we've got some of the world's top players out there. Kylian Mbappé, and it has arrived, the opening statement in this UEFA Champions League final. Well, let's take another look, and it's not good enough defensively. They're slow to react, don't get tight enough, and don't deal with the situation. And there's the outcome. in United's favour. Moving the ball forward with purpose. And a passing sequence that's easy on the eye. Now the attack fizzled out. Neymar. Here's Ronaldo, back to Ronaldo, very alert defending to cut off the supply. Messi, magnificent challenge to win it back. Can he take advantage? Not the best clearance. Well, no damage done. Mount. And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. Well, it nice to work out for them. Oh, it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee, and maybe they'll be able to level this up. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. And now to level the game. A goal! Accurate from the spot! Well, here it is again. Great composure to send the keeper the wrong way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent penalty. So back underway, they've leveled it at 1 1 here. Verratti. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. It's looking promising. It was on its way in. They 
favoured a short one here. Ferreira. And return to Messi. The fans are shouting, shoot! Mbappé! In it goes! But wait a minute, that will not count. Well, that was tight, but he was just offside. It was a good finish, though. Ronaldo and a strong tackle making progress is Kylian Mbappe and there's the pullback Lionel Messi and they couldn't quite muster a real threat Rashford well that ball looks promising how about the cross? I think most defenders would expect to be booked halting an attack in that fashion. But it is a caution, and quite frankly, he can't really quibble. No, it's been coming, hasn't it? He's got to be careful now. He could get a red if he's not careful. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Well, 2-1 it is here. Manuel Ugarte. But that's enough. Vitor Ferreira. Neymar makes his way forward with purpose. Options around him. Really good challenge. Here's Luke Shaw. Here's Matt. Ronaldo. On to Casemiro. The ball back with PSG now. Mbappe. Oh, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? He has time to play us over. And they stop them in their tracks. Mbappe, on to Messi, back to Mbappe, not the pass he had in mind, chance maybe to use the counter-attacking ability to good effect, Marcus Rashford, that's really good and effective physical play, Bruno Fernandes, it has to be, no hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead, well that was a poor miss, could they come to regret that? So nearing the break, and it's United on top. Stuart, how about your critique of their first half display? Well, it's been a good first half so far, and they've been the better side, certainly going forward. They now just need to keep playing with intensity right up to the break. Valanci. Excellent defending. Valanci. On 
to Messi. Return to Verratti. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. In position here to protect the ball. And the referee's whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium. And the ball moving again. Advantage United, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns here. possess your opponent fine run from Mbappe chances on As you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. Casemiro. Here's Mount. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Mbappe. Well, they might be able to launch a counter attack. Arati. Ugarte. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. And PSG will have a throw in. Well, they know they need to stop him. Now he must play with the cross. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Defence of Brazilians to shut them down. Here's Luke Shaw. Rashford. Here's Mount. He could pick out a teammate. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Hernandez. Nuremage. Now with Akimi. Ferreira. Ugarte. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Rashford. Now with Shaw. And making sure there was no danger in the end. Marquinhos. Ferreira. Now space for PSG in the wide position. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And that'll be a United throw.
here's Luke Shaw. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. Ericsson. Rashford. Textbook defending inside the box. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Pereira. Good patient build up as they try to fashion something. But then the commentator's curse comes into play. Oh, yes, what a pass. Ronaldo. And nicely parried away. Verratti. Here's Mbappe. PSG on the attack as the minutes tick away. What can they do in the closing phase? Counter-attacking chance. Sancho. How about the cross? Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. He has teammates around him, but really sticking to the task defensively. Five minutes to go. Lionel Messi. And the advantage is with PSG. This is looking threatening. Can he put them in front? The supporters want to see him have a go. Neymar. Oh, great defending. Cristiano Ronaldo. Marcus Rashford. Good use of advantage in United's favour. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Manchester United on the front foot in the closing moments. Can they find a winner? Well, that's the sign of a well-organised defence. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes. But this is not over. And two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. United. Understandable that fatigue might set in. A strength sapping night for all concerned as the first period of extra time begins. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that will put them ahead. And it could be an opportunity for PSG to take the lead from a corner. Played over. Attacked it well, made decent contact, but he couldn't keep it down enough, could he? Marcus Rashford. Eriksson now. It's with Martinez. The tackle completely missed time, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card.
managed it nicely. He's an effective clearance. Jadon Sancho. On to Juan Bissaka. Here's Juan Bissaka. Jadon Sancho. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. Sancho. On to Juan Bissaka. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Garati. Now oh, can they hit them on the counter? Well, a disappointing end to that break. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. And slipped through beautifully. McTominay. Now with Juan Bissaka. And they might forge ahead. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. for the first period of extra time let's see what the second has in store well extra time continues we're into the second period now forward trying to catch them out Diogo Dallo and making sure there was no danger in the end Asensio and he's got past his man my goodness that save what a stretch he was one for his own highlight three What can they do from this situation? The delivery from Neymar. He did his job defensively. Ericsson lost possession. PSG chasing this game. They're not out of it. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. This could square the game. And it has! Such great excitement. And no wonder they're jumping for joy as we speak. Another equaliser. What a topsy turvy game this has been. Time is fast running out. Five minutes left in the second period of extra time here. Sancho. Scott McTominay. 
And the pass deftly cut out. Well, a stylish moment. Well, the crossing needs to be a bit better than that. And we will have just one additional minute. Still level here, but Manchester United making a push near the end. Sancho. On to McTominay. After 120 minutes, they cannot be separated. And so, in this Champions League final, it comes down to a shootout. And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a player, this is when you have to hold your nerve. That's what you call a mischievous penalty with a stutter step. He had to score, and he does. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. And he scores. That wasn't easy to do. Superb. Execution. Well, the Panenka has duly fooled the goalkeeper. And high into the top corner. Outrageous. And the keeper denies them from the spot. And it's gone in. Such high levels of pressure. He must score to keep his side in it. been engrossing today such a tight game that you have to feel sorry for the losers they were so close but yet so far away and the party mood has enveloped the stadium it's going to be quite the night of celebration here don't need to be reminded about what comes next it's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy well there's some tired players out there but what you can be sure of they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy they'll be going mad in the next few moments the Champions League winners Manchester United well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. Manchester United are the winners of the UEFA Champions League.